Hi guys, welcome back to Next Step Immigration. I hope you are doing great today. The New Brunswick Provincial Nominee Program, or NBPNP stream, will be covered in this video. NBPNP is among the most frequently used programs due to its simplicity of use and speed of processing. Watch the entire video to discover how to apply for Canada PR under the NBPNP program. What streams are included in the NBPNP? The New Brunswick PNP program accepts applications under a number of immigration streams, including express entry, skilled workers, corporate immigration, strategic initiative for French-speaking immigrants, and the Atlantic Immigration Program. Being the most popular and sought-after NBPNP stream, we will go through the specifics of the skilled worker stream in this video. The skilled worker stream is intended to help New Brunswick firms meet labor shortages by attracting foreign employees. Employers who are unable to fill vacancies with Canadians or permanent residents may make employment offers to prospective overseas employees through this program. Foreign employees and recently graduated overseas students who receive a job offer from a New Brunswick firm should strongly consider this program. The Atlantic Immigration Program and the Nova Scotia Nominee Program are pretty similar to this one. What are the requirements? A permanent, full-time work offer from a New Brunswick business is necessary for prospective employees. The offered job must be one that neither a Canadian citizen nor a permanent resident is qualified to fill. Priority is given to applicants in skilled jobs with national occupational categorization levels of 0, A, or B. If candidates fulfill all qualifying conditions, they may be considered for employment at NOC level C, which is a semi-skilled occupation, or D, which are low-skilled position. Candidates must be between the ages of 19 and 55 at the time of application, have at least a high school diploma, and hold the relevant education, training, and or certification, as applicable, for the position in addition to having a job offer. They must have language skills at least equivalent to Canadian language benchmark CLB4 in either English or French. They must have at least a year of work experience in a position related to the role during the five years before the application date. They have to receive a minimum score of 60 on the NBPNP selection criteria assessment grid. The applicant will be assessed taking into account factors including age, language ability, educational level, prior work experience, flexibility, and priority industry. If your desired employment is in the manufacturing, transportation, healthcare, education, or business service centers sectors, you might receive 10 points. Unlike the majority of Canadian immigration programs, this one does not need you to provide financial documentation. Also, the company who extends the employment offer must fulfill specific criteria. An employer must have a permanent establishment in New Brunswick that has been in business for at least two years before providing a position to an applicant. Moreover, the company must provide proof that the employment cannot be filled by a Canadian citizen or permanent resident. Typically, a favorable labor market impact assessment, or LMIA, serves as evidence of this. LMIA is not necessary for this category. The business may be able to demonstrate that the job is already exempt from LMIA regulations. How do you apply? An employer information form that has been filled out and signed by the employer and the applicant must accompany every application filed through the NBPNP skilled worker stream. One must have accepted an offer of full-time, permanent work from a New Brunswick company that is prepared to support them throughout the NBPNP process in order to be eligible for this stream. When you're prepared to apply, you must first establish your candidate profile on the Immigration New Brunswick website and submit it. You will get an invitation to apply if you fulfill the stream criteria, and you will have 45 days to submit your whole application via the New Brunswick online portal. After receiving a formal provincial nomination as a result of the approval of your application, you can next apply to the federal government for permanent residence in Canada. Because this stream is not compatible with the Federal Express Entry System, you must submit a paper-based PR application. To submit your NBPNP application, you must pay a $250 non-refundable charge. If nominated, successful candidates may also be eligible to get a temporary work visa, 
allowing them to go to Canada and find employment there while their application for permanent residency is being processed. The NBPNP officer may attach a letter of support for a work permit with your nomination at that time. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and enable the notification bell to receive updates on job and immigration news. Thanks for watching. Good luck.